Hi everyone, it's me, Mr. Gaming Guitarist, and um, I wanted to talk about how um, awful uh, Uber is treating their drivers. I, th I already made a video talking about how they are now paying us, the drivers, a lot less money, and now the thing that makes this shit even worse is they decided to insult us by... They, they said that, oh, to help with the cost of rising gas prices, they are now going to give us 55 cents extra per trip. Are you fucking kidding me? 55 cents. That's it. That's it. So, so if I, like over here where I live in Texas, gas is like $4 a gallon now. Or at like the lowest I've seen it now is 3.89 per gallon for regular gas, and you know I know that everyone's gonna be saying, "Oh, boo hoo!" I live in California where I have to pay over five dollars. Well, you know what? It's an increase. It's still an increase because guess what? I still had to pay before. In the past, I only had to pay for less. Before it was less than two dollars and fifty cents in 2020. That's the only positive thing about the goddamn pandemic. Now it's like even worse than than normal because they increased it. Because over the last few months, it's gone up by a dollar. And now it's even worse. Because that means now, so 55 cents, right? So it will take what? Me driving 10 pat I can't even do the math. I'm so fucking pissed off. Uh, but all I know is, so you're telling me that if I drive about, what, 10 passengers in one day, then I'll barely be able to pay for one fucking gallon. That's fucking bullshit. Because if Uber actually gave a fuck and they actually wanted to fucking help us, you know what they should do? Give us, I don't know, maybe 55 cents per mile. That would be a lot fucking better. I'm, and the thing that I fucking hate about this is even despite all these fucking complaints... Uber is still the highest paying job I've ever had, and I'm not qualified for anything else, and the convenience of Uber is far too great because, as I'm sure you are plenty well aware of, I've got major depressive disorder, and that means that there are days whenever the stress of life becomes too overwhelming, and so I thank God for that go offline button because if shit gets too stressful, then I can just press go offline, drive home, and cry myself to sleep. And that happens, and that's happening far more fucking often than it used to. Because this is fucking bullshit. And this is, you know what, Uber, this is what needs to happen. There needs to be more fucking competition. Just like YouTube needs more goddamn competition. I don't fucking understand it. Why for... 15 years, there's only been YouTube for the place to upload videos, and, you know, everyone's gonna say TikTok. No, fuck TikTok, okay? That's made for the fucking generation younger than me, that, uh, whose attention span is, like, worse than a fucking, worse than a fucking fly, where they can only hold their attention to watch fucking 10-second videos. It's fucking bullshit. Anyways, that's enough of that. Because I am, because my God, it's like, I'm only 27, and yet it feels like I've aged about 20 years in the last, you know, three or four years. So, um, anyways. This 55 cents per trip extra is a fucking insult. And Uber and Lyft desperately need some competition. Why is Uber and Lyft in taxis? Why is that the only way to get a ride? That's fucking bullshit. There needs to be more. There needs to be more companies so that Uber to so that Uber and Lyft can get their fucking shit together. 
because I'm, and the other thing that sucks about this shit is, is there's a strike going on on St. Patrick's Day where the Uber drivers are not going to work on St. Patrick's Day and it fucking kills me that I can't participate in that because I need to pay my rent and my car payment, which I'm being overcharged for both with because of my stupid fucking credit. So, anyways, as I'm sure you can tell, I'm extremely fucking stressed out. I always am, because life is bullshit.